Well, welcome back to the third day of the AI for Good Global Summit. And I'm joined now by the chair of the IEEE, the Computer Society. His name is Andy Chen, he's with me now. Andy, good to see you. Good to see you. What is the IEEE? Well, the, it's the Institute of Electronic and Electrical Engineering, and it's a professional association. We have about 400,000 members globally. And I'm focusing in uh, computer society, which is focused on the computers and engineering. And what brings you to the summit? Well, I uh, basically, I was invited because of my background in several areas. One, um, my, my expertise in the power generations uh, for cyber securities, um, as well as my knowledge in the nuclear industries. But more importantly, uh, my position as a board chair for the uh, IEEE Computer Societies, where we would like to be able to work collaboratively with the different nations. We have about 160 countries that we have memberships on us. So almost every part of the globe, we have students join our, our associations as well as professional who already graduated. And as we're on day three, what's your thoughts about this three-day gathering? It's quite amazing. Um, it, and it's a, it's a very eventful. And there are so much opportunities. There are so many different aspects of um, the global. There are people interested in academia, people interested in government relationship, uh, and people interested in researchers and people in the industry. So it's really interesting bringing the tech company as well as the government policies uh, and the different levels. It's really, it's, it's, it's fascinating for me. And you're talking um, in your panel discussion about everybody sharing the benefits of AI. Will that happen or are you concerned that it is not happening? Well, I think one of the key thing, important thing, and I was in the panel as, a, as, a, as monitors, is that you have to design it correctly. You have to put in some what we call ethics, just like people, into the AI. So it does the right thing, it doesn't harm people, it does actually the benefiting the human being rather than 